Hello, I'm Dr. John Rostin, President of the California Optometric Association, and this is my July President's Minute. I'm here at the state capitol, and as uh, many of you know, our SB 492 has passed out of the Business and Professions and Consumer Protection Committee. So we're very happy about that step. Um, 492 allows us to expand our services and to redefine optometry in a way that makes a whole lot of sense for the, the, the time that we're practicing here. So now the, the bill moves on to the Appropriations Committee. So this is a time where we need to gather together and really make our voice heard. Appropriations Committee is a committee that analyzes the fiscal cost to the state uh, for any type of uh, measure that goes through either the Assembly or the Senate. After appropriations, then, the bill must pass both the full Assembly and the full Senate before it goes to the governor's, uh, for the governor's signature. Well, here are some of the specifics about uh, SB 492. It, uh, it eliminates the list of medications that we currently have for eye topical treatment and instead allows us to use all FDA approved medications, eye medications that are indicated for the treatment of eye disease. The bill also authorizes doctors of optometry to become trained and certified in advanced procedures such as lumps and bumps and also therapeutic lasers for the treatment of glaucoma. In addition, the bill authorizes doctors of optometry to administer three immunizations including flu, shingles and whooping cough for individuals over 18 years of age. So we got a lot of things here in this bill. We want to see it uh, to the finish line. Uh, that's where you are such a critical part of this process. We, our grassroots efforts have been tremendously successful. We're going to be having uh, another local legislative day in the in the legislators' districts. Uh, these will be on Friday, July 18th, and Friday, July 25th. Please sign up for that. It's really not a lot of time out of your office since it's in the local district. Maybe take a little longer lunch and be sure to have your voice uh, heard. So I appreciate all your efforts. Uh, let's join together. We're heading to that finish line uh, and let's make our, our voices count. Thank you.